basket at Petiti Garden Center. Isn't that pretty? Beautiful petunia. Oh, they've got all kinds there. But this year, I thought to myself, why don't they make like a cover for the, uh, the bottoms of the pots? You know, it doesn't have to be a hanging basket. It could be any kind of a pot. So I came up with this really great idea. I love it. And I love recycling. So we got some of Aunt Blanche's old plastic tablecloths from down the basement that have been uh, sitting down there for years. Isn't that pretty? And this is what you're going to need. You're going to need a plastic tablecloth. You're going to need a measuring tape. You're going to need um, some ribbon, any kind of ribbon, raffia, uh, tw twisted ribbon works too. You're going to need these Velcro dots. And these adhere uh, very good. I mean, they'll last through the summertime. And then you're going to need some wire. So all you, I've already started this project. Uh, you're going to lay your tablecloth out flat with the decorative side down. Then you're going to put your pot in the middle. Oh, you need a magic mark, marker to it. I forgot to tell you that. And then you're going to draw a line all the way around the bottom of it. Take your pot off. And in the middle, you want to put a dot right in the middle of the circle. Then, you're going to measure the radius. Ours happens to be three and a half inches. Then you're going to measure the height of the basket. Ours is six inches. So you're going to add that together, three and a half and six. If my math is right, that's nine and a half inches. So we measured out from the dot to the end, nine and a half inches. And with our wire, cut a piece of wire that was nine and a half inches. This is going to be our, our measuring device. This is a quick way to measure, make sure everything's all even. Okay, nine and a half inches. We already cut the piece. So you're going to take one end of the wire and hold it by your dot. And then a little windy today. Huh? And then all the way around with your magic marker. You're going to draw a line. So hold it here. Helps to have somebody help you, but you can do it by yourself. So that's what we did the whole way around. So we've got an even, Steven circle there. Okay, then we cut it out. And then we set our pot back on top. And we got out our Velcro dots. And again, these go on very easy. We just take a dot, put one on the bottom. And we put one on the top of the pot. And they're sticky on the back, so they stick really easy. Okay. You get the idea. You do this all the way around about mm, every few inches. Okay, so you get the idea. It looks like this. And then, to make it even prettier, you're going to take any kind of ribbon, whatever you have. And after you put all your Velcro down, you're going to make a pretty bow. You know, you get the idea. So it looks like this. I did this one earlier in the week. This is that twisted ribbon. Isn't that pretty? So, just another idea for... Uh, your garden accents. It's our May craft of the month. And if you've got any ideas for the summertime, please email me. I'd love to hear from you. Just go to nancy at wdok.com.